Good morning, Internet. Welcome back to the Incredible Paradise. I made a bit of a mess. So, I redid some... That's a... Yeah, a lot of magma over here. Anyway, I redid this. I had two pumps in there. I didn't need two pumps. I screwed something up and my uh, liquid valves I had in there to reduce flow got... Anyway, I knew I had to break back in. A little bit of natural gas came out. Not the end of the world. I figured if I was going to break in there, I could put this auto sweeper in. So it can hit those two tiles and then I can grab the sulfur. And then I put this on a sensor just so it's not running all the time. It just turns on, grabs the sulfur, and dumps it here on the ground. My dudes come and grab it. I don't think this milligram of natural gas is going to matter much. I, of course, took out that pipe that I said, oh, I need I need this pipe because I'm going to screw this up. So, yeah, I got to put that back in. I can just use this pipe. And probably just toss them in the gas pump right there and call it good. So, that'll help out, keep that cleaned out. If I turn this up, maybe I'll need to put the second pump in, but anyway. So, another quick thank you to all the people who watch the videos and, you know, I normally don't say like, comment, and why is there oxygen in here? Why is there oxygen in there? Did I melt a pipe? Like, I knew this one broke because a puff dropped a bit of oxalite there, but there's still that. I don't know where that oxygen came from. Anyway, back to what I was saying. Thanks to all the people who like and comment the video on the video. It is... Awesome that so many people ask questions and other people respond to them and I respond to them and it's a great little community. So I'm just very thankful that people are watching and that is way too much poop water. Yeah, we'll dump that in there. But my big plan for today is one, get this cleaned up and we're heading over to the other base. Just actually you... You're probably due for a break. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I am just so low on material that I just need to head over and start colonizing another base because I got nothing. Let's see how many data banks we've got. Welcome back, Liam. Dirt's an issue. So, after we wake up, we will send probably my best digger. No, no, I'm like, that's not right. There we go. 1315 or Rowan 1016. Actually, it's probably going to be Rowan. And Rowan's just about to wake up. Perfect. Oh, out in space. Uh, I think I covered this. This is all that I've seen. I. I did get in orbit of this planet. And there's a beta hive right up there. So I might actually do a radiation this time, a research reactor. Rowan, come here. And teleport. Let's take a look at this new base. All right, we got water, we got stuff and stuff and that's the top and I don't see any of the teleporters so I gotta go find those right now I'll just have you take off and then we'll just go straight up and down with some sandstone some granite oh I paused the game I'm like I thought the game crashed uh, there is a mutated seed
Mostly I'm just looking for the teleporters to get stuff in and out of here. Ooh, that looks like one. Like, I don't need to see the destination. Uh, I live there. To inspect everything. Oh, there's the oil biome. And it doesn't look like it's all super broken in here, so that's good. And dirt is what I really need from here, which is why I need the teleporters. Ah, I'll row and dig for a bit, then we'll come back. And you guys are loading up all the data banks. Oh yeah. Perfect, we're about halfway through the dirt research. Mash can be nice to my dupe and give him a bathroom first. There we go. I mean, his priority is not to do that, but said to emergency real quick, and now he's got a bathroom. Still sleeping on the floor. That's okay. Uh, maybe that's not a teleporter. Son of a... And this looks to be broken, but not horribly. And there's oil up here. I'll probably use the vent trick. There's one up here, so let's just have a look. That is polluted water. Heck yeah. That is a very useful one to find, and that's not a teleporter. Oh, cool steam. Very nice. Lots of iron. That's helpful. I want to find the teleporters. Alright, well, there's another vent. What are you? Natural gas. <laughs> Am I blind? Alright, let's have them come up. I really thought finding the teleporters would be slightly easier than this. Oh, there's another vent right there. What are you? Hot polluted oxygen. Still no teleporter. Rowan, you're going to keep digging until we find one. Well, I found another vent. There's the chlorine vent. Hopefully the teleporters spawned. They must have. Come this way a bit more. That I can see all of, so I guess that's the other big area I can't see. come up like that see if there's something in that corner and then this corner usually they're up near the top but eh, they could be anywhere I found one nice all right with that Rowan you can take a break actually his stress is only 53 percent but yeah we'll get him out of here we'll swap them for Gossman here in a bit I just wanted to find the output so that I knew where to go with the next dupe.
Nice work, buddy. Let's say take a break, but I haven't built a massage room. I did build a kill room. Why are there extra... Yeah, whatever. I'm all about getting the free meat. I had all my critters in here and they weren't dying. So now we've got this set to auto wrangle, not Drekos. So everyone else goes move to the kill room. So how do we make out on data banks? Hold on, I'm going to add these up. I have 342 data banks. I need 558 more. So unfortunately, uh, Liam here. Oh, that's probably what happened. Someone was delivering oxalite. Somebody dropped some oxalite in there. So yeah, 558 more, Liam, or close to that. I can get more from the other base. And then I've got this opened up so I can start digging that out. And you're eating magma at a decent enough pace, not quite keep, keeping up. So yeah, we'll wait for that recharge and then we'll get Gossman over there, take another look at that base. And you are down in a vacuum. I think I'm just going to leave that pump there. And then this auto sweeper is being cooled or warmed, depending on how you think about it, by this tile. And these guys went and cleaned all that. Perfect. I was just looking at these gas tanks, wondering why they aren't emptying because these are dormant. I completely forgot that I put this onto the main grid. So I don't need this at all. So I can empty these tanks and free myself up some more room. And get some metal back. Well, I don't think I should have sent my hatch eggs up into here. They should go. I redirected them over to here. So let's start uh, wrangling hatches. We'll leave the cuddle pits in there. I like the cuddle pits. Because they'll eat my food. <laughs> and that's a problem. Or, you know, we can just go for some mass murder. That works. <laughs> yeah, there's still a bunch of eggs in there we'll have to deal with. Yeah, we'll deliver all the meat. I'll be good. Is Gossman healed? Looks like it. Gossman got a little bit hurt, so I hadn't sent him over to the other base yet. Ah, so much cleaner. Plug you into you, and that's done. Cover some more metal. All right, and your job is going to be, I want to avoid the satellite. Yeah, we don't need that. That we want to open up. And see what he finds. 
Well, this dig pattern isn't going to work. I'm going straight up into another vent. Oh, I even knew that that vent was there. Alright, we can come like that. Not much I can do about the chlorine. Oh, there's even a glossy Draco in there. Nice. Well, that gets me all the way up into here. So... I guess the four corners might as well come straight down from here and see what I find. Forty-five percent stress. Eh, you can probably make it. And oxygen over here is a bit of an issue. Oh. Well, my dupes aren't really going to be able to make it through there anyway. Guess I can have them leave their suit on, but Gosselin's suit here is a worn out suit, so he definitely can't get down in there. Alright, buddy, we'll let you dig this last little bit. No, let's prioritize this bit over here. And then we'll get him out of here. I figured the other thing we should do is get him a massage table. Yeah, see what is that medicine? Massage. A couple of little these guys around there. Yeah, time to get out of here. But he looks like he's hurt. Maybe that's just the stress. There you go, buddy. And I did dump an extra suit over into here, so once he runs back through, he'll get a suit. Nicely done. I can't quite see whatever the thing is that's overheat. This thing. This is the thing that's been giving me the overheat warning for forever. And I can't get to it. That's my recharge. 38%. I thought about sending my researcher over here to activate things. But not at only 38%. It's going to take too long. Just keep waiting. How are you doing? 230, so halfway there. Of the 558 I need, there's 230. Yeah, my, I, and I know my main limit's the dirt, but as soon as I actually start settling that other base and have these activated, then I can definitely have dirt shipped over. Let's hook you up to oxygen right now. You are the input. And that one's output. Ooh, more magma. Oh, I'm going to have to come up with a plan on something to do with all this. Later. I should be close enough to send a dupe over. Camille, you seem good enough. Wherever you are. Nope, nope, nope. You come activate. It's helpful if I click the activation button. And after that, we are going to want oxygen pipes.
I could help. I thought this was one where they slap. They just gotta hold their hand there. Yeah, that's boring. Almost there to a nice source of clean oxygen. Yeah, I suppose there's enough algae around here, but it's just so much easier if you just have it shipped over already. It'll basically be nice and pressurized by the time I get the rest of the dupes over here. There it is. And yeah, it's kind of nice over here. It's a bit thin everywhere else. But while I'm waiting for this to finish recharging, you can go through and finish that up. And I've not seen a good builder digger in some time. That's the last dupe I want for this base. And I just have not seen one. I think with that, I can get Camille out of here. Nice work. Yes, we got oxygen flowing in. It's going to take a while to pressurize everything. But the point is, we've got output, so I get food and oxygen over here. You are in orbit with some obscene amount of data banks. Need another 200. Perfect. Well, I think I'm going to call that good. Thank you all very much for watching. Thanks for coming out and checking out my videos. Please, if you have any questions or comments, post them. Love to hear from you guys and love to see the response from the community when people have ideas or questions on gameplay. But now that I've got oxygen going over to the other base and the teleporter's active, I can actually start settling it in properly and hopefully I can get down to that other teleporter and get the dirt back to finish off research. And I hope you all have a wonderful day and we'll see you next time.